chosen ones, don't get insulted, don't get offended about what I'm about to say. Some chosen ones are homosexual. Um, but you got to be careful who you befriend because a lot of times people befriend you because they're sexually attracted to you. And here you are thinking, this person knows I'm gay. This person knows I'm straight. Why are they coming at me? You think that you're making a feminine connection with them. You're going to do your girls trip. You're going to do your brunches. You can talk to them about guys. And the next thing you know, this female friend has been trying to get at you sexually. This has happened to me so many times. I never saw it coming. A lot of these women actually were married to men. So what happens is the chosen one's spiritual energy, their light, their aura, is that bright. Their healing energy is so strong that people actually think they're sexually attracted to them. Okay? So if you're a man, be careful with the homeboys that you make. If you're a woman, be careful with the female friends that you make because it's not always what you think it is. And I've had women get angry with me, get aggressive with me because they're like, I thought you knew what this was. I thought you liked me too. And I'm like, girl, what are you talking about? So this is a pattern in chosen one's lives where, shoot, you could be straight. And next thing you know, a, a gay woman or gay man is running after you. And you're going, what are you talking about? I've had gay men trying to get with me, telling me I was the only woman they ever experienced being attracted to. And what it is, is that these people... These individuals needed healing energy. You have the wisdom, you have the healing energy that they need. And that's why they think that, oh, I gotta be sexually attracted to this person. I have to be physically attracted to this person. But that's not what it is. So be careful when you're befriending people. It's not always what you think it is. Some people think, oh, I'm gonna be a good friend to them and get in their drawers. So be very careful, chosen one. Sorry for the noise, I live in New York City.